up everybody welcome back to my channel today i'm going to be showing you guys how to get this look right here zane um it's a product that i picked up from ulta this is going to be a first impressions video hope you guys enjoy this and let's jump right into it all right so my brows are on 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 you guys always got to follow how i talk um my brows are on this part i don't have a primer I didn't pick up a primer from Ulta. Oh, I do have a Ulta Beauty primer, and it's the Hydrating Face Primer. And we're going to be using this. Let's see how this works. Three new concealers from Ulta. As far as concealer, I'm going to be using the Better Stay Skin on my brows for an applicator. There's not much product that comes on the brush, but. So I'm carving out my brow bone. And this is a more natural concealer shade, not a highlighter. Oh, I'm not the only one that hates blending out around your brows. Now this is, I picked up the e.l.f. Um, concealer brush. I had this a long time ago, but I remember I used to blend out around my eyes with this, so this is gonna be my first time trying this out again in years. And it is blending perfectly. bring you guys closer okay did purchase a palette from Ulta and this is gonna be my first time trying this makeup revolution palette here so these this is what the shades look like not really an eyeshadow girl I'm still learning how to play with colors but I do want to show you guys Morphe um, what do you call this Full coverage concealer, but it's obviously white. White. And I would hope ain't nobody just white. So I'm just gonna dot this on my eye. So we're gonna see if the, if it makes this shadow pop um, a little bit more. I use that same e.l.f. concealer brush. Start popping that in my crease. darker brown color here and just start building that right here and going in using my glitz and glam palette um if you guys want to know if any more information about this palette i'll link it down below i do have a description i mean i do have a coupon code um, this is Glitz and Glam Cosmetics. Her name is Elizabeth. She actually hand makes all of her shadows. They're handmade, um, and they're so freaking pigmented. So, pop on this shade right here. shade in the glitz and glam palette and okay okay so y'all remember when I told y'all I didn't buy a primer I specifically searched three different ultras to find this find this elf putty primer we're gonna try this out now this I kept hearing really good things about everybody was comparing this to the Tatcha Silk Canvas Primer. This consistency is very similar to it as well. So 
I'm just gonna try this out. I've been hearing great things about this. I'm not gonna use a lot because it kinda does feel like an oil base. That's water base, but sitting in, I'm gonna finish my eyes. This is something that I already had. It's this Kat Von D um, Lock It Tattoo. Uh, what do you call this? Liquid liner. I'm just not fooling with it. I'm not really good with the eyes, but let's just move on to foundation. This video is already long enough. Three new foundations, and I bought like triples and doubles of these three because it's really hard to find foundations that's on sale. Here's the Candid one by Revlon. Then the Revlon Insta Filter, which I think I'm gonna give a try, and the Alme one. So I think I'm gonna give this one a try today. The applicator is like a, looks like this. So. Ugh. Perfect shade. Hi, mommy. So the color is perfect. I just don't like how. Let me try to fix my lighting. I... So the color is not bad at all. And so far I like the way the foundation blends. This is the number four. I'm gonna go back and get a number three. I haven't seen this. This is an e.l.f. camo concealer. I got this from Target. And I do need a shade darker in this one, but I just need my under eyes to pop. Yes? Okay, that's better.
this time using Ruby Woo, the mini one. I'm sodding. Super matte and super red. This is like that universal red. Looks good on any shade. But this is really, really pretty and I'm really feeling it. Um, like this video, if you guys did, definitely give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. That subscribe button is right down there. So don't forget to click it. Join the Couture Creative Fam and I love you guys and I'll see you guys soon.